charades. Before we get started, let me introduce you to our fellow players. First of all, you know Miss Brandy. Say hi, Miss Brandy. Hello, it's so good to see all of you. Oh my goodness, it's so good that we could be together in some way again. And I want you to meet our special guest, Miss Chelsea. Say hi, Miss Chelsea. Hi, good to see you. And Miss Chelsea has something to tell us. So, Miss Chelsea, can you tell all of us about summer reading? Of course, Brandy. Summer reading is going on from June 1st to July 31st. To sign up, you just need to go to our website, click Tales and Tales, select uh, Log Reading, and that's where you can sign up using Beanstack to track all the books you've read since the beginning of the program. Oh, that sounds so fun! And easy! Yes, absolutely! Yeah, and when you reach your reading goal, you'll be able to win a goodie bag and a free book. And then the more you read, you can win tickets to put in prize bundles. Oh, that is fun. I can't wait to see what kind of prizes there are. There's a lot of fun ones this year. And while you're on our website, you should check out our calendar to see what virtual events we have this summer. Oh, I'm going to do that right away. Okay, so first things first, let me read the rules to you. That's the boring part of any game, but it's necessary. The three of us have each placed two cards with the name of an animal and a hat. When it's a player's turn to act, they will draw a card out of the hat and will be given 30 seconds, maybe less, to try and get the other players to guess the animal they are pretending to be. We want you to guess too. Once the actors, 30 seconds or less, are up, the other players will have a chance to offer their guesses. The player to guess correctly gets to take their turn as the actor. Okay, to help everyone guess what the animal is, you might, when you're acting out, give clues. And the clues that we have come up with are for the animal's habitat. Where does the animal live? And the different uh, signals we're gonna use are forest, it's trees in the forest, rain forest, um, farm, uh, if it's a domestic animal that lives in the house, a pet, so they live in a house. If it lives in a jungle, your chest like that, and if it's in the, uh, if it's in water, we're going to do the ocean sign, but it, that works for anything that's just in water, is a wave, and if it's in the sky, it's a bird. Have I left anything out? Mm -hmm. I think that's everything. Um, and then as a last resort, if nobody can guess it, then the actor can either make the animal sounds or can even, in the voice of the animal, okay, you have to be the animal, you can give clues as to what you are. You ready? I'm ready. All right. Miss Chelsea can hold the thing. Um, should I go first? Yeah, you okay. go first. Oh, it's me. <laughs> okay, what have I got here? Oh, okay. Here I go. Are y'all ready? Mm -hmm. Okay. Water. Mm -hmm. Oh, goodness. It's something big. Is it big? Oh, my goodness. It's huge. Oh, no. It's small. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Are you a goldfish? Oh. Mm. Are you a starfish? <gasps> oh my Yay! goodness! Yay! 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 Excellent! Okay, Miss Chelsea, it is your turn if you okay. want to choose an animal. Alrighty. to this morning? She's, oh, she's itchy. no. She's, she's really itchy. itchy. Goodness, do you need to take a bath? <laughs> oh, no, that's not <laughs> it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I think she's a lemur. Mm -hmm. A lemur? 
A monkey. A monkey. Are you a monkey? Yeah. Oh, Mr. Yeah. Monkey! Yeah. <laughs> okay, Miss Brandy, it's your oh turn. My goodness, let's see what it is. Oh, okay. Should we? Yeah, yeah, you can get that in there. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. Hmm. It lives in a house. <laughs> she needs a bath. Oh, she, she does need a bath. bath. No? Oh. oh. Cleaning yourself? What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> um, how it's, it's got paws and it, it putting its saliva on its body. It's uh, It lives in a house and it jumps. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Miss Chelsea? What could she be? We're rabbit. <laughs> what do you yeah. think she is? Cat? <gasps> is it a cat? Oh, it is a cat! Did you yeah. guess cat? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's get ready for round two. So far, Miss Chelsea has two points. Miss Brandy has zero, and Miss Carrie has zero. Sea stars can regenerate or regrow their arms if they lose them. Some can regrow a whole body from a small portion of an arm that has been severed. Also, some species have up to 40 arms. There are over 260 species of monkeys worldwide. The largest species is in the mandrill in Africa. The males have an average weight of 71 pounds. The smallest is a pygmy marmoset, weighing just 3.5 ounces. Cats spend about 70% of their lives sleeping. Geez, they sleep between 13 and 16 hours a day. A group of kittens is called a Kindle. Now that's not what you're reading your summer reading books on, is it? No. And a group of adult cats is called a Clowder. Not chowder, clowder. That's right. In 1963, a French cat named Felicette went 100 miles into space into a big rocket ship and she made it safely back to Earth by parachute. She was the first cat in space. With Miss Brandy. Miss Brandy? A 
frog? No, I, I didn't realize there were frogs in the ocean. <laughs> really? I think they're just in water is what. Oh, okay. But this Chelsea, was, I knew that was a frog the second okay. she got down there. I just couldn't think of the word. Oh, okay. So, All right. That was good. You should have worn your glasses. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway. Oh, okay. A ballerina. <laughs> A ballerina. <laughs> A ballerina in the jungle. This is a slop. that they don't think is safe, they will reason that it might not be safe and they won't commit to doing what it was they were thinking of doing. Did you know that a male donkey is called a jack and that a female donkey, that's a girl, is called a jenny? Frogs have excellent night vision. Also, with their bulging eyes, most frogs are able to see what's front to the sides of them and partially to the back of them. When a frog swallows food, it pulls its eyes down into the roof of its mouth to help push food down its throat. <laughs> Sloths sleep up to 20 hours a day. They move so little that algae grows on their fur. They come out of their tree once a week to use the bathroom. They also have two extra vertebrae in their neck so they can turn their heads almost all the way around. I love learning all these wonderful facts about different animals. But you know there's another place that you can learn about all kinds of animals and that is at your public library. We tally up the points. Miss Chelsea has four points, Miss Brandy has one point, and Miss Carrie has one point. <laughs> yeah, and <laughs> I think that means that Miss Chelsea was cheating. Uh oh! <laughs> no, oh. Miss Chelsea won fair and square. Oh, yay! Yay! joining us for our game of charades and we are looking forward to seeing you in the library. So I have the greatest joke for you and it has something to do with the animals that we were playing charades about. I know this is a good one. Get ready. Okay. Winnie the Pooh has a best friend, 
and I want to know if you know how does Winnie the Pooh's best friend paddle a boat?